Greetings and welcome to Books for Busy Students. I'm Lauren, a librarian at the Ray Howard Library. Thor, Goddess of Thunder by Jason Aaron asks the question, who is Thor without his hammer? If Thor's hammer is the source of all his power and Thor is defined by this power, does that make him not be Thor anymore once the hammer is lost to him? After going head to head with a malicious dark elf who wants to set an army of ice giants on Asgardia, Thor uncharacteristically loses a fight where his enemy chops off his arm. When a new character appears that is able to wield and control Thor's hammer in ways he was never able to, Thor challenges the stranger to return his hammer and end the sorcery that has separated him from his powers. Find out how the masked goddess of thunder not only takes on Thor's enemies, but amidst the chaos finds time to kiss Thor too when he asks if she's his mother. This volume puts an end to the questions about what to call the new Thor, even though we get some pretty funny suggestions from Spider-Man, such as Lady Hammerpants and Thorita. For the record, she's now Thor, and the original Thor goes by his actual name, Odin's son, now that he's without his powers. Thor, Goddess of Thunder by Jason Aaron is available now at the Ray Howard Library, along with other exciting graphic novels. Thanks for watching.